friends, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Kristen, this is Intentional Living, and today we are doing our last stuffing of all for August. Um, this is our fourth side hustle, um, cash stuffing. And so we are stuffing $641 that I made on Etsy. So thank you so much if you support me over there. So let's give it a count. We have 150, 250, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 400. 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 500, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 600, 6, 10, 15, 25, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, and 641 dollars. So it's all here. We're just going to dive right in and get going. So as always, we start with our business binder. And we put 25% of what we make towards taxes, which is $163. So 150, 60, 1, 2, 3. So 163 is going in. And now we have 5,000. 1, 2, 3, 400, 20, no. 400, 500, 600, 700, 800, 900, 1,000, so 6,000, 1, 50, 2, 50, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 400, 10, 20, 30, 4, 35, 4, 40, 4, 41, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6, so 6,000, wrong color, 6,446, I think. Four forty-six, so six thousand four hundred and forty-six dollars in taxes. My products are getting fifty dollars. So now I have one thousand one hundred, two hundred, two fifty, and three hundred. So thirteen hundred there. Equipment is not getting anything. Shipping is getting fifteen. So a ten and a five. So now I have 500, 600, 700, 800, 820, 830, 835, 840, 845, 46, 47, 48, 49, and 850 in shipping. Office supplies are getting 10. So I have 150, 60, 70, 80, 95, 200. In office. Marketing is getting 85 today. I'm going to put five into giveaways. So 100, 200, 5, 10, 15, 220 in giveaways. And then I'm gonna put 80 into $2 bills. So 50, 70, 80. So I have one, two, 300, 50, 400, 20, 40, 60, 80. 90 for 90 so 710 in marketing yeah and i'm trying to get ahead on two dollar bills in here just because i am going to close my shop before black friday and i get a lot of orders for black friday so i'm going to need more two dollar bills right away when i open than i usually do so yeah that's why i'm bulking that up Bills is getting 20, so Instant Ink is getting 5, 5, 10, 15, 25. QuickBooks is getting 5, 10, 15, 25, and 30. YouTube Premium has 30, so we're not adding. Amazon is getting 5, so I have 150, 5, 65, 75, 175. Canva has 135. Cricut has 165, and then P.O. Box is getting five. I don't have a five, so put this five down and grab a 10. So 50, 70, 85, 95. So I have 655 in bills. And let me check what Amazon had. 
150, 60, 70, 175 in Amazon. And let me look what my yearly payment is. I know, I wanna say it's a little bit more than that. Keep it on my tracker. Amazon's 180 and I don't pay it till November. So I only have one, five more dollars, one more week. And then I'm done with Amazon and can stop stuffing that. That's nice. My business emergency fund gets 5% um, of whatever I make, which was 33. So 20, 30, one, two, and three. And I think this was a little more than it was supposed to be because I wanted to even it out before the condensing. So I have 1,000, 2,000, one, two, 250, 270, 290, 310, 330, 350, 370, 380, 390, 400. So 2,400. And 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So 2,420 dollars in my emergency fund, which is awesome. And then professional development is getting its usual five. And I will put down a five and grab a 10. So I have one, two, 300, 10, 15, and 320 in there. And that is it for my bill or my um, business finder. And this is for my Etsy shop. This is design number two in sunshine yellow and sky blue. For my take home pay, I like to put 15% towards my retirement. So that is $40 today. We're adding that into Roth IRA. So 20, 40. And let's see how we're ending August. So for August, um, not for my full-time job, but just from side hustles, I have um, put all of this towards my Roth, or I'm going to. So I have 50, 1, 50, 200, 50, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 400, 20, 40, 60, 80, 500, 505, 510, 511, 12, 13, and 514. So $514 just for my side hustle on top of what I already do from my full-time job. So that's super exciting. So there's that. And then we're not adding anything to my wallet binder today. So we're gonna go straight into my long-term spending binder, which is my black binder. And we're gonna start with clothes, which is getting 10. So I have 100, 10, 20, 35, 45, and 150. Sorry if you can hear my um, boyfriend is <laughs> assembling a table. So sorry if you can hear that. Costco is getting 20, 30, 40, 55, and, or it isn't getting anything, but it has 60. Also, I just saw this and I can't let it go. Date night has 20, 45, and 50. We're not adding to that. Fitness and wellness is getting 20. So we'll add in a 20. I'm gonna take these ones out for the $1 challenge. Gifts is getting $5. I'm gonna put down a five and grab a 10. So I have 20, 40, 60, 75 in gifts. Giving's getting five. But I'm gonna put down a five and grab a 10. So 10, 15, 20, 5, 35, 40. And we'll put these ones down. So 40. 
42, 44, 46, 48, 50, 52, 54, 56, 58, 60, 62, 64, 66, 68. I'm giving. Going out has 250 and is not getting anything. Haircuts has, I think it's 150, 60, 75, 85, 95, 100. Yes, so that has 100, so that's not getting anything. So that's fully funded. Planners, though, is getting five. We'll put down a five and grab a 10. So I have 20, 30, 45, and 50 now in planners. Self-care is getting 10, um, but I'm going to pull out these ones and grab a 10. So I have 100, 20, 30, 40, 50, 65, 165, 120, 30, 40, 50, yeah, 165. And I still haven't pulled out my massage, so I need to do that. Volleyball is getting five. So I have 10, 15, actually I'm gonna put this down and grab a 10. 10, 20, 5, 35, 45 in volleyball. And buffer is getting five. So now it has 20. I don't know why, but I thought volleyball was gonna be at 50 after today. Maybe not. This says it should be at 40 today. Oh, because I need to put down another five. I just put down the five I picked up, right? 10, 25, 35, yeah. Okay, I'm glad I double checked that. So that should be 40, not 45. I was like, that just feels so wrong. I thought I had that ending with a zero. So there we go. All right, so that's it for my long-term spending. And we're gonna go to my month ahead binder where I'm trying to get one month ahead on my bills. And we are doing that in here. So we are adding $40. So let's see, five, 10, 15, 20, five, 30, and 40. This is what's going in there. I just like to take it out to be sure I'm putting the right amount in. So rent is getting $5, so I have $25, $35, and $40 now in rent. Utilities is getting $5 and should also have $40, $25, 35 $40. Phone is fully funded with $60. Apple is fully funded with 10 and then giving. I was going to keep stuffing, but then I changed my mind. So I'm actually gonna take those five out and put it towards the next thing. So this is also gonna be fully funded again with 30 because I can't make up my mind about anything. And let's make this a little note. There's that. Um, okay, insurance then. Okay, so then one of my rent is a lot. Utilities are a lot. What's the next thing I'm stuffing? Insurance would be like 95. Yeah, I think insurance is the next biggest one then. So it should get, okay, let's see. I should have done this before. Okay, rent. So I have $40 and rent gets five. Utilities, five, phone, nothing, Apple, nothing, giving, nothing. So then insurance, I think should get 20. And then Roth gets five and Jim gets five. So that's five, 10, 15, 20, 40, yes. Okay, so insurance should get 20. Well, I'm gonna give it the five that I took out of giving and then give it 20. So, and I'm gonna put back 
two of these fives in this 10 and get a 20 since I can add a 20. So now on insurances, we have 20, 45, 55, and 60. And I'm gonna put a sticky note saying 20. That's what I should be adding in here. So this is like how I'm snowballing it. So each category started by getting $5 and then as it gets funded, I put that $5 towards the next category. So like it just keeps snowballing and you could keep adding more and more and more until they're all filled. So yeah, so rent's gonna be the last one I, I fully fund. And it'll take a minute to get there. Okay. So that was insurance for $60. And then we're gonna add five into Roth IRA. So I have 25, 35, 40 in Roth. And then my gym memberships gets the last five. So 25, 35, and 40. So now I have $320 in my one month ahead fund, which we did a lot of moving around of things. So I'm gonna double check that, but it sounds right because 32 is a multiple of four. Yep. So 320 in month ahead. And we have three categories fully funded, which is exciting. All right, on to savings. We're gonna get baby blue in here. Birthdays I am not stuffing, but we have $30 for my friend Bree, whose birthday is this Saturday. And then we have 100 and I think 30 for my niece. Yeah. So we have 160 in birthdays. My emergency fund is getting 20. So I have 10,000, 100, 200, 250, 270, 290, 310, 330, 340, and 350. So 10,350 dollars in my emergency fund, which is awesome. Electronics, we are skipping. Holidays, we're adding five. We have 30 in Indigenous Peoples Day, 50 in Halloween, and I think 50 in Thanksgiving, yeah. So then Black Friday is getting five and now it has 10. So I have 140 in holidays. Joint savings is getting skipped, um, but medical is going to get five. So now I have 500, 600, 655, 65, and 670. I'll pull out those ones. So 670 in medical. Pet emergency fund isn't getting anything and future wedding isn't getting anything. So that is it for this binder. And finally, we've got Big Blue, who's a little thinner now that Deck of Savings is out of here. Um, but Car is getting 60, so 50 and a 10. Putting that into repairs, I think. So I have five, six, seven, 800, 850, 870, 890. Right, five, six, seven, eight, fifty, eight, seventy, eight, ninety, nine, ten, nine, thirty, nine, fifty, nine, seventy, nine hundred and ninety, and one thousand in repairs. So one thousand in repairs, a thousand in emergency, a hundred in oil changes, and two fifty in deductible. So I have two thousand three hundred and fifty, and that is amazing. That'll be super fun in the condensing. Um, Christmas, I am fully funded at 1350 so we're not stuffing that anymore. Home is just going to get five, and I'm going to put that towards first house, I think. Or is hosting done? No, I'm going to add it to hosting. So now I have 150, 60, 70, 180, 185 in hosting. Plus in home maintenance, I have 265. Plus 100 in Rosie, who is my sweet angel baby dog. 
And then yard work has 20. And then furniture, I have 470. And then first house has 5, 20, 40, 60, 560. So I have 1600 in home, which is super exciting. And then travel is getting five. Um, weddings, we have five, six, seven, eight hundred. And I'm gonna pull these two dollars out. So I think I'm gonna leave this as eight hundred in weddings. Plus these two hundred and two hundred dollars in weekend trips. I think I'm gonna add the five in the friends trips. I'm gonna pull this one out and I'll put in a ten and take out a five. So now in friends trips, I have 20, 40, 60, 80, 95, and 100. And then I have 200 in future vacations, 200 in me and Colin trips, 200 in girls trips, 200 in family trips, and 200 in staycations. So I have $2,100 in travel. And then I need to get an envelope for Busy Lizzie's budget, Busy Lizzie's budgets challenge. I'm probably just going to call it the Busy Lizzie challenge, honestly. Where is her box? There it is. So maybe I'll just use this de the deck of savings envelope because it's right here for now, but I'm going to be doing Busy Lizzie's challenge. I unboxed this in a video a while back, but this is Busy Lizzie budget, Busy Lizzie's budget challenge. That's a lot to say. Anyway, this is her YouTube and her Etsy. Check it out. Um, she sent me this and it's a scratch off challenge and it's a summer scratch off, but you know, it's not too late. I'm going to do it. So I scratch off 12 off camera and I'm just going to round up to 15 because I don't mess with ones. Um, so we're going to add 15 and we'll just use this binder. So now we have 15 to start off this challenge. And let's scratch the one on the back and see what we're going to do next time. Okay, I got a one. So what we're going to do is stuff five next time. And I'm going to use my scratcher card in here. And I like to leave her business card up top so we know whose challenge it is. And it's in a cute little box. So we're going to be doing her challenge next. And I have no clue how much it saves. So we will find that out together. But that is it for Big Blue and for this stuffing. So let's see how many ones we're going to take to the $1 challenge. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, and 16 dollars going into the one dollar challenge for quarter three or for this stuffing but towards quarter three and that is it for today's video thank you so much for watching the next video is going to be a cash condensing and then I'm going to be doing just like a financial check-in video so that'll be really good you won't want to miss it so stay tuned for all those videos subscribe if you're not already and I'll catch you in my next video bye